I'm all like this, eh? <laughs> based on one or two, normally, now they run every morning, now based on my three sharp updates, you need to hear. First and foremost, anywhere where they watch this video from, I greet you specially. If you like good talk, I don't get respect. I greet you now. Based on one or two, now, they say we cannot do two waste time again because that are not the that are not cause. So, go inside the matter sharply, sharply. But I beg, make I just quickly beg everybody. My new comedy series, Oversabi Chef, it is. Uh, the first episode they drop tomorrow for my YouTube channel, Keobeki Comedy. I think God beg you. Help me go subscribe to the YouTube channel. And when the video drop, I beg. When I help me engage them, when I support your boy also. Oh yeah, that's how we enter the matter. Sharply, sharply. The first matter where I break on today, so. <laughs> uh, normally, they say no smoke without fire. <laughs> like this, like this, so. NLC. The leadership of NLC don't fall. I don't talk to me. <laughs> Uh, they say if NAPC or federal government dare to increase fair price again, <laughs> say they go hear from them. They go hear from them. <laughs> and they say this time around, say if they increase the fair price again, say the strike this time around, there, <laughs> turn down, not go strike, reach this strike, but they won't strike soon. <laughs> now the warning where NAPC, where, where NLC break come out like this one. <laughs> because the last week, I remember, say, Last week, the up the fellow said that they had some kind of women. We say NLPC and FG, they want to increase fair price again. <laughs> now, NLC said they dropped this one in Sudan at the first update. The second update, that be big, 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 big. <laughs> As NLC, they talk their own. You know, this one is so sharply, sharply. NLPCL, don't come and I don't reply. NLC, say, Wala, whoa, whoa, I beg you. When I look us, I want to do. They don't come and I don't declare NLC, say me, I beg. NLCO, TUCO, Nigeria, so, I beg, oh, we not get any plans to increase fair price, oh. Moon, I don't go to TCO, we increase fair price, I beg, oh. Now, NLC, come out, the NAPC, come out, talk this money, say. They don't get any plans to increase fair price, say, they don't, yet wear, they don't know where NLC for, yeah, their own gist, whether they come out, they come out, treat it there, so. None of the second gist. No worry, relax, I go give them the full gist, just that just, I'm not the countdown. Oh, to the last gist for today, that be big, 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 big. <laughs> Normally, I don't say <laughs> the big inside Labour Party between a Papa and uh, Aburi. <laughs> Otto said the matter no call what I get. That's how we not continue. We not continue the touch light the matter. So we got lock up like a come based on one or two. But that don't mean say the matter not say the call to because like this, like this. So <laughs> last night, so the happy court now don't give the, their ruling on the matter. They don't rule say man now Julius Aburi now be the authentic chairman of NLPC of a, of a Labour Party. I will give now the full gist now. Well, I said this. I'm gonna start the gist proper, proper now. Take a big win. Anywhere they watch this video from, I bet do me one small favor. Help me share this video. Make another person see him. So that anybody will get interest for this kind of matter. May the office see him. May they know what the sub for inside the Nigerian lifestyle. I beg. On to our first gist of the day, which is that NLC matter and everything where they talk to uh, federal government and NLPC before they cut off their own. They all listen to the full gist now. He said the Nigerian Labour Congress on Monday warned that its members will commence a nationwide strike without any formal notice if marketers increase the pump price of petrol without concluding the ongoing negotiations. The NLC president, Joe Ajero, admonished the federal government to stop the uh, f uh, falling value of the Naira. The threat by the organized labor followed hints by oil marketers on Sunday that the cost of premium motor spirit, popularly called petrol, would rise to between 680 Naira per liter and 720 Naira per liter in the coming weeks. Should the dollar continue to trade between 910 Naira and 915, uh, 950 Naira at the parallel market? The marketer said dealers seeking to import PMS were being forced to put the plants on hold due to the scarcity of foreign exchange to import the commodity. The warning came barely one week after the local currency crossed the 900, dollar to, uh, 900 Naira to a dollar ceiling. With the naira selling at over 945 naira to a dollar at the parallel market on Friday, what the last said the CBN importers and exporters official uh, official window for forex exchange 
which boasts for a lower exchange rate of about 740 uh, naira per dollar had remained illiquid and unable to provide the 25 million dollar to 30 million dollar required for importation of PMS by dealers. In the aftermath of fear subsidy removal in May, the organized labor had attempted to down two over the skyrocketing price of goods and services, but the federal government secured an injunction from the National Industrial Court buying them from embarking on strike. In a bid to avert a strike by the labor movement last month, the federal government had, through the Federal Ministry of, In of Justice, secured an order from the National Industrial Court restraining the NLC and Trade Union Congress from embarking on any strike action over issues budging on removal of fuel subsidy, hike in price of petrol, and consequential increase in cost of living, pending the, the, the determination of the suit. The, solic the Solicitor General of the Federation and Permanent Secretary, Federal Ministry of Justice, Mrs. Beatrice J.D. Agba, in a statement urged the NLC to withdraw the seven-day notice it issued on its plan to commence a nationwide industrial action from August 2 if demands of labor unions were not met. The Justice Ministry sternly warned in a statement on July 26 that the planned strike by the union will be contempt of court an offense that is punishable by jailing. According to the federal government, such an action would amount to a resort, or, or, or to, a resort to self help since the matter was already pending in court. Anyway, now that one we just told that she's there for the NSC matter. Sharply, sharply, also the second gist, which is the sharp response where NNPC can reply to NSC men and Nigerian men, they're not get plans to increase fuel price. Or, yeah, with their own G's for inside now. He said the, uh, the NAPCL has said it has no intention to increase the retail price of petroleum. The oil firm said this in a statement posted via its official Twitter account on Monday night. It tweeted maybe this one so. Dear esteemed customers, we at NAPC retail value your patronage and we do not have the intention to increase our PMS pump price as widely speculated. Please buy the best quality product at the most affordable price at our NNPC retail stations nationwide. Okay. The, the NNPCL made the, the clarification in a reaction to reports in the media that the, the company was said to raise petroleum pump price from the current 617 naira per liter to between 720 naira per liter and 750 naira in the coming weeks. In its reaction, the NAPCL said it has no intention to increase its petrol pump price as widely speculated. Uh, here now the uh, gist be that one onto that NAPC matter. On to our last story for today, which is the appeal court ruling concerning the Labour Party leadership. Listen and be blessed. He said, in a unanimous decision, the three member panel of justices dismissed the appeal of the appellant. It will be recalled that the plaintiff, Lucky Shaibu, said to be a member of the Labour Party in Ward 3, executive in Eastern North East local government area of Edo State, suspended Abure. In the late judgment, Justice Teresa Ungolika Oji Abadwa affirmed the decision of the High Court of Edo State and held that one man cannot suspend the national chairman of the Labour Party in line with Article 13 and 17 of the Constitution of the Party and the Extant Electoral Act of 2022, particularly when the appellant has been described by the party as unknown. Press release. Court of Appeal affirms Aburi as the national chairman of the Labour Party. Court of Appeal sitting in Benin City, Edo State Capital, as affirmed comrade barrister Julius Aburi as the national chairman of the Labour Party in the case of Mr. Lucky Shaibu versus Julius Aburi and five others. His Lordship Justice Teresa Ungoli Kaoji Abadwa, JCA, Fatima Omoru Akimbami, JCA, and Honorable Justice Sibyl O Nwaka Bagi, JCA, in a unanimous decision, dismissed the appeal of the appellant. 
It will be recalled that one lucky tribe who claimed to be a member of the Labour Party in Ward 3 executive in Eastern Northeast local government area of Edo State suspended the chairman of the Labour Party. In his lead judgment, the Justice Teresa Angolika Agbado affirmed that the decision of the High Court in Edo State and held that one man cannot suspend the national chairman of the Labour Party in line with Article 13 and 17 of the Constitution of the Party and Extant Electoral Act of 2022, particularly when the appellant has been described by the party as unknown. The court unanimously nullified the earlier suspension uh, and all actions taken against Comrade Julius Aburi and the party arising from purported suspension. In a swift reaction to the judgment, Comrade Julius Aburi eulogized the judgment and team of justices who refused to close their eyes to the justice of the, of the case. He also thanked the team of selfless lawyers led by G.C. Igbokwe S.A.N. Peter Obi Wild, the, uh, Peter, Peter Obi Wild, the impostor, Mr. Uh, Lamidia Papa, and his adherents, who tried to off the mandate freely given to the Labour Party with billions of naira expended by his paymasters in the opposition parties. GC Igbokwe SAN, the counsel to Comrade Julius Abri, applauded the judgment, describing it as sound, courageous, and uh, unimpeachable. Reinstated the that reinstated that Comrade Julius Abri Esquire remains the national chairman of the Labour Party until the party convention holds. Press Agbukan Esquire had uh, can, uh, lead counsel to Labour Party said the decision of the Court of Appeal has given a rest to the battle of the soul of the party. According to him, it is a landmark judgment that will stand the test of time. Anybody still associating with impostor parading themselves as factional leaders of the party does so at their own peril. Political parties must remain watchdog of the national conscience. Signed, Obiora Ifo, National Public Publicity Secretary, Labour Party, 14th of August 2023. Anyway, I did just what I this morning onto my three sharp updates where you need to hear. Anyway, just thank God for everything.